Hey, Ron here from Military Images Magazine with a new episode of Life on the Civil War Research Trail. You know, I sometimes worry that those of you who watch these videos are left with an impression that I work alone, living some hermit-like existence, shunning people in society, emerging for a few moments every morning to share a story before I crawl back into the research rabbit hole. Well, nothing could be further from the truth. In my role as editor and publisher of Military Images magazine, I'm in regular contact with a vibrant group of individuals who, like me, want to share stories from the past. One of those individuals is Elizabeth Topping. She's a contributing editor to the magazine. Elizabeth has helped me learn to appreciate the varied roles of women during the war, a range of folks from daughters of the regiments like Katie Brownell of the 1st Rhode Island Infantry, who I profiled in yesterday's video, to today's featured individual, actress and poet Ada Isaacs Mencken. Elizabeth described Mencken this way, quote, Mystique cloaked her personal life. Vague about her birth and heritage, most sources agree that she was born in the South and spent her formative years in New Orleans. She married and left five husbands. Her sexual preferences varied as she took lovers of both genders who were famous writers, poets, musicians, and artists, the Bohemians of New York and Paris. Her offstage scandalous behavior landed on newspaper front pages and cemented her distinction as the world's most famous, highly paid actress. Elizabeth also noted that Megan can be, can be fairly called America's first sex symbol. Elizabeth also described Mencken as a fame fatale as a result of her tragic and early death in Paris soon after the end of the Civil War. Elizabeth's full profile of Mencken will appear in the spring issue of Military Images magazine. It's currently at the printer and will be mailed in mid-March. If you want to learn more about the magazine or subscribe, go to shopmilitaryimages.com. Hey, thanks for watching, and we'll see you on the next episode of Life on the Civil War Research Trail.